This is uh, Robin Williams' first appearance on the, um, on the Tonight Show. Um, he doesn't do many outside appearances. I think I saw him about three years ago. I think he was on uh, with Dick Cavett one night. Did you know he's the star, uh, star of the very successful Mork and Mindy show, which is uh, beginning its uh, fourth season on the air. I begin this Thursday. And he's going to be seen a new film late next spring called The World According to Garth. Did you ever read that book? I read that book. Interesting, yes. funny book. Would you welcome Robin Williams? <laughs> The power. Freeze the Jesus. And Sears had a sale this furniture went cheap. <laughs> oh my God. I'm okay now. I'm out here. Mama, I'm on TV. <laughs> For my friends in San Francisco, how are you? no. That should wake him up. That's a laid back place up there. Do you believe? No. Hello. Don't touch the back of the TV. It'll shock you across the room. <laughs> know the power. Grab it now. Do you watch those, do you watch those guys on Sunday? Oh, yes, they sir. They got some winners. That would, some without win mentioning any names. No, right? no, really, because they come to your door going, Hello, here's your watchtower. <laughs> 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 I'd like to say hello to you. Yes. Hare Krishna, Hare Lama. But I don't want the book. Take the book. It's free. <laughs> Take the wig off. They go, Please, no, Hare Krishna, Hare Lama. <laughs> they, they got a hair thing, don't they? I mean, most of those evangelists are very... Yeah, very much. Of how the hair looks, and they got great suits and great ties and Wonderful big stuff. carnations. Big, big dead roses right here. <laughs> <laughs> I could not save this flower, but I will save you. <laughs> <laughs> Believe, no. Save baby. Save baby. baby. Yeah, oh, you know who we're talking Come about. Come on home, take anything you need. <laughs> <laughs> take the Cuisinart. No, it's good. <laughs> Well, they must look in Europe go, what did they do? <laughs> America, why? <laughs> Keep adjusting over there. Yeah, well, well, this is a nice, nice outfit. outfit. Yeah, somewhere there's a car seat real envious. <laughs> so, man, you got my car seat. Come back here with a... Oh, God, you I'm were right. Last time I saw you, you were with Cabot about three years ago. Yes, sir, and that's why I haven't done anything since. Oh, come on. I'm a little scared. I was standing backstage about to go on and everything. All of a sudden, my whole body went, everybody out. <laughs> we have two exits. Any way you want to leave, everybody out. All of a sudden, I said, dear Lord, make my cheeks of ice. <laughs> so that's why I walked out a little bit like, good evening. Nice to be on the show. <laughs> I said, oh, no, the pants fit now. Okay. People always think reformers don't get nervous. Not at all, really. No. I don't. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> not really. Not at all. Not, real. not me. No way. Is there some reason you don't do this? Is it fact that you get nervous? Do Very you much many so. Shows? I, I suffer from severe dyslexia, too. Oh. I was the only child in my block on Halloween to go trick or trout. <laughs> here, we go. Oh, look, here comes that young Williams boy again. Better get some fish. <laughs> here you go. Say hi to your mom and dad. <laughs> where, <they> find you? <laughs> oh. where, where is home for you, or did you come from a home? <laughs> <laughs> They said, all oh, the people of the institution, Tommy, <laughs> if you haven't taken your medication yet, it's going to be fine. <laughs> They're back at 12. Back at 12, yeah. No. How are you, Mr. Williams? I'm real fine. I'm... <laughs> Look at this thing. Look, Flipper. <laughs> <laughs> right now, there's a saw man going, what are you doing? <laughs> Oh, God. I better relax, relax, relax. It's okay. I'm on it's TV. Right, just... You're a nice man. You won't hurt me. No, no. No, no. <laughs> Hold on. Let me just one sip. One sip. It's okay. Thank you. Don't be afraid. <laughs> the simplex two is it? Yeah. One. One or a two. A real man can stand up to herpes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, whoa. <laughs> wow. Too much coffee, Tommy? <laughs> You don't think I spent 19 years here drinking this stuff? You gotta... Yeah, how are you? Late night TV. Uh, a little juice in there to keep yeah, going. Yeah, like, You know, it's wonderful, though. Yeah. I think... I don't know. I better slow down now. Slow down. My heart's going, you fool. You know, people see you, and they probably think you experiment with uh, foreign substances in your body. Medication, you mean? Yeah, something. <laughs> what makes you say that in any way? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> not me. No, I <laughs> That's right, got him, got him. Yeah, no. yeah. Seriously, no, how are you? You know, people get howdy doody jaw. How are you, okay? <laughs> no, because I believe that cocaine is God's way of saying you're making too much money. <laughs> <laughs> No, I wouldn't take any medication. You couldn't. 
You see, the girls at the Rainbow Barn Grill have taken one too many quaaludes going, Is my lipstick on? <laughs> <laughs> it's very like, oh, look, it's Emmett's girl. <laughs> How are you? I'm fine. Yeah, she's a cheap date. <laughs> oh, no. I was asking about your home. I think. Where, oh, home? Yeah. Where, where is home? I, San Francisco. I wonder. That, that's, where, yeah, home. grew up there. Went to a Gestalt high school there. Gestalt high school. <laughs> I used to have a history teacher on acid going, I'm Lincoln today, I'm Lincoln. <laughs> My problem was there's a kid in the back who goes, I'm Booth, I'm Booth. <laughs> White faculty. Yes, no. Were you good in school? Or did no, you, were you acting up like this all the no, time? No, which very, is great. I was kind of geeky in school. I was very yeah. quiet, very like, wow, what are, what are you guys doing? <laughs> okay, that sounds reasonable. <laughs> well, I have to go away now. You. <laughs> Whoa, what are those? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I, yes, I was very right, quiet. <gasps> Look. Look out there. It's a new world, and I've just flunked out. <laughs> I don't know why. I have to sell vibrators door to door now. <laughs> Madam, have you ever seen these attachments? <laughs> <laughs> it's nice that I ended my career with you. Oh, yeah. No, no, stay right here. Stay right? We have to sell something. Oh, yes. But we're going to return right here in I'll be gone, though. Thank you, Doc. We're talking with Robin Williams. Deep discussion of the issues of our day. <laughs> Thank the boys in the band, too. Each and every one of them a real dude in his own right. <laughs> look, look, little Ronald Reagan pencils here. Yes. They have no point. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. There's a tax audit for me. That's right. Hello, Mr. Williams. We're time to audit you and your firstborn again. <laughs> Nancy and I, you know, I noticed a very strange thing about him, yeah. though, he never speaks while Nancy's drinking water. Do you notice that? <laughs> She's dubbing him. Would be. Yes. Would be. And her lips never... <laughs> I'm happy. <laughs> well, that should get me audited again. Yeah. You speaking at first when you have no children. No, sir. Not that I know of. <laughs> well, none of them have gone, Are you Mr. Williams? Yes. <laughs> You're my daddy. <laughs> and you owe me, let's see, by present account, $8 million. <laughs> I'm not Mr. Williams anymore. You don't, uh, you, you're not even married. I, I am, yes. Oh, Honey, he didn't mean that. Oh, I didn't. <laughs> She's at home loading the handgun going, I didn't mean to shoot my husband. He came in late. Honey, it's... <laughs> oh, too much coffee, Marilyn. <laughs> no, I'm married. She's going, show him the ring. There it is, little, little porpoise going, help me. <laughs> Another sip of coffee. Now. Yes. <laughs> Whoa, yeah. Somebody told me you went to a serious acting school. Yeah, what's Juilliard? Where was that? Juilliard. Hmm. Right now, there's some guy going, what instrument did you play? <laughs> Say the organ. I said, no. What? <laughs> you wanted to be a serious? Serious actor. Serious Shakespeare. Actor. I was there when John Hausman was the headmaster. I remember him saying one day, Mr. Williams, I need you. I'm going off to sell Volvos. <laughs> Make I'll buy it now. We make money the old-fashioned way. Yes. We raise the interest so high. <laughs> yes, we'll be calling you soon. Did you ever appear in Shakespeare? Yes, sir, I did. I, I remember I was just coming from California. They, they had the Shakespearean auditions. I was going, to be or not to be, wow, for sure, totally. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm sorry, next. Thank you. So we did plays. We did Romeo and Juliet. Did you do them straight without wanting to go off and be silly? And no, break I, up? I had, you had to do them straight. There's a little yeah. man in the wings. Like, come in. Violence things. What's wrong? You blew it. <laughs> but, but time and great. Oh, wow. <laughs> I would like to see them. I think they're going to do Hamlet on ABC this fall, except it's going to be called Chucky, the story of a stir boy. <laughs> <laughs> it's probably ratings week. Yeah, yeah ratings yeah. week, and that'll be instead of to be or not to be, I don't know, we'll call you. It'll be. <laughs> do you remember the whole soliloquy of to be or not to be? No, no, it'll be like to be a oh, line. Um, you're not to be. <laughs> well, it is noblest of the slings and arrows of. Needless with need, no wrong. Outrageous one. fortune. Outrageous fortune. Or to take arms against friends. See in the sea of troubles. And by wow, this is great that you know all this. Oh. <laughs> and by opposing, end them. But yet a man who will know himself, but yet not touch himself. <laughs> what, what, is, what is that from? Is that Midsummer from, Night's Dream or yeah, what? That, that's from the self abuse soliloquy. <laughs> <laughs> and yet a man will know, and yet look. Vile fool, come thee hither. No! Thou hast forced me to wear designer jeans for no reason. 
I will walk now and cameraman still going, where's he going now? <laughs> Where am I now? This thing's broken. <laughs> uh, <yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> Japanese people go, Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> Believe! <laughs> Hello, bless you. Bless you. Give me your hand, don't be afraid. Men can touch men. <laughs> All right, sir. I got, look up there. Look, Jean-Claude Keeley for Jimmy Dean Pure Pork Sausage. <laughs> Wonderful, man. There's so many people up there. What's happening, Michael? <laughs> There's people up there going, Hi! <laughs> we waited three hours! Where are you? Oops, there's a cameraman trying to... Let's really make the cameraman mad now! No! <laughs> oh, no. It's very strange. Very bizarre. This lady going, come over here, I have something for you. Put those away, I don't want to see those now. <laughs> All right, this is wonderful. This is very, very wonderful. This is, reminds me of home. <laughs> this is your first time in Los Angeles. Stay away from the bars with the big Harley Davidson 8000s parked in front. Because <laughs> there's big men standing outside those bars. Men, giant men. Men with muscles everywhere. Men with muscles on their eyelids. <laughs> And these men turn to one another and say, I have this incredible recipe for quiche. You know what I'm talking about. I feel time. I would like to do the only impression I do. It's Fred Astaire on the streets of New York dealing with caca. Thank you. Right now you're going, get him out of here quick. <laughs> Here we are, Fred Astaire. Can I, this one won't, I won't need the microphone. Can I give this back to some? Hi, how are you? <laughs> I'm not paranoid, but why are you behind me? <laughs> Everybody off! Thank you, I, I'll leave this over here for one second. I'll be right back. I, the sound man. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Don't be afraid. <laughs> I'm just so happy to be in America. <laughs> Fred Astaire in New York. Once again, we don't have to say the second syllable. I don't know. There's a time... <laughs> I'm sorry, it's over now. That's all right. Oh, you know who is, uh, we were talking during the break that who's uh, going to join is part-time on the show or full-time? Full-time. Johnny Winters? Oh, yes, the king. Yeah, he's uh, you're obviously a fan of his. Oh, like yes. I am. He's wonderful. God. Yeah. Uncle John, if you're watching, <laughs> take care. <laughs> <laughs> Don't let him bounce you around the rubber rooms anymore. <laughs> hey, Gray Bear, I'm here with the silver fox. <laughs> Gray Bear, Gray Bear, I'm home now. Billy Bob Joe Jeans. <laughs> He wanted me to do that, and he said, if you don't do that, I'll hurt you tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs> did you know, John, in the early years, uh, like I did when we both uh, mm. uh, hit the sauce a little bit? No, no, sir. Oh, yes, we got in all kinds of trouble. Really? He is He's, absolutely... He still gets in trouble. <laughs> Does he? <laughs> he was wandering around the lot yesterday in a Union Cavalry officer's outfit. <laughs> and you see people wandering around going, there's studio executives going, you know what? <laughs> Good God, what's that? <laughs> He's going, you men, stay over there. Keep wearing the Gucci suits. We'll put you in the front line. <laughs> Like, whoa, whoa, no, no. <laughs> oh, he's wonderful though. He's just yeah. he's truly the spirit of joy. Yeah, he's it. In they flipped his wings though. It was like, like no, don't let him fly too high. But he's he, like, he yeah. plays, he goes off. He's a great talent. You just have to sit there and go, where is he going now? <laughs> the old days uh, we went into Chasen's restaurant. You know, it's a very high class place. And he uh this was when we were Happy Times. Yeah. And he walked in and started doing the rape of grandma. Remember that? Oh, yeah. He says, I'm church. Lenny, people. what are you doing? And the whole bar just <laughs> left and everybody, people were piling into the streets. Oh, God. <laughs> Fun time, so. You finished this movie already. Yeah. The, uh, how'd it go? Well, it was wonderful. I had a great time. I was working with great actors, Mary Beth Hurt and people like that. Yeah. And I get very serious now. People are going, he's not being funny. No. <laughs> yeah, is, that a, is that a problem they expect you to be no. constantly? Yeah, some, sometimes they expect it. It was wonderful. I called home the other day. 
Hi, Mom. Mork, is that you? <laughs> Mom, put Dad on. <laughs> Mork, son. Dad? <laughs> put Scruffy on. <laughs> Mork! Mork! No. I don't know. Some... That's asking too much. Yeah. yeah. But it was fun. Yeah. It was great to... He was the one... George Roy Hill was the director, and he's incredible, because he's very... The first day I tried to improvise, I was, it was a basic, it was a very simple scene. It was like, yes, I would like to do that. And then I went off beyond the line. I went, yes, I would like to do that. But first we cut. That's a wrap. Get him out of here. <laughs> then he makes his face when he'd be behind the camera. If he didn't like a scene, he'd go. <sighs> it's very hard when you're having a love scene going, turn your eye and you see the. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's get out of here. <laughs> but it was a good experience. It you really and uh, Peter Richard Pryor have been working at the, uh, where, the improv? The comedy store. The comedy store. I worked the improv. Mitzi, it's going well. Yeah. And we, we worked there every night. And I worked the improv sometimes. Yeah, that's great. In the boarding house in San Francisco, plugging all the clubs now and saying, I'll be back, don't worry now. You're a funny guy. Thank you, really you sir. Yeah. Thank you. Great to have you, you here. You too, thank you. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Do I get one of your suits now? No. no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you get a suit. You get a suit. Please, tell me what. Look at this. This is. I feel like a little kitty. <laughs> <laughs> oh my, it's coming unraveled though, right? <laughs> My wife and I, we liked a macrame of Volkswagen one day. <laughs> oh, this is so much fun. I, I'm not scared anymore. Don't well, Why should you be? Well, I, you're right. This is, this is fun. <laughs> My career is over, but I'm not scared. <laughs> I can see it tomorrow in the National Enquirer. He's gone. We knew he'd do it. <laughs> I don't know. National Enquirer, though. You and I both love that magazine. Uh -huh. Aha. Right. Yeah, well. <laughs> you know, the strange thing is, though, I put it in the cat box, and the cat won't go in there. <laughs> He sits in there and the cat goes... <laughs> His little eyes go, why? That'd be redundant. <laughs> <laughs> you got it. Right. Yeah. Strange place. Really high class paper. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Lose weight after death. Exciting new diet. <laughs> <laughs> and here's a chihuahua in a cup named Mickey. <laughs> oh. They go for the weird yeah. stories, don't they? Yeah, but... Well. Man shoes off own foot. Yeah. You know, this high class. No one ever sues the National Geographic, though. Be, That's true. It's a... <laughs> that was my magazine through puberty. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> that would keep me cranking for about 10 days. <laughs> 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 turn, right to, turn right to the African section, right? Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> uh, New Guinea, New Guinea! Yeah. Uh, How are Java, you? Java, 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 Java. Yeah. Yeah. Well, the soundtrack, too. <laughs> <laughs> well, what There'll are you be a man waiting for me now. Yes. Are you Mr. Williams? We have another sip of this one. Oh, we have to turn No, help us out. No, please. You know, I'd like to taste this one more time. But it is real coffee. Mm -hmm. If you believe that, you'll buy this watch. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're going to take a break. Yeah, sure, but we're coming back. Stay where you are. Come first down. Would you welcome, please, Gene Marsh. <laughs> See, Robin shook hands nice and. I read an article in the paper the other day that people who go to cocktail parties now start kissing complete strangers, and they blame television for that. Because when people come on shows, entertainers what? normally kiss each other, so people are... Well, I only kiss you if I know you. I didn't kiss him, whoever he is. I, I did watch your show. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, Mr. Williams gave me two roses earlier on. Yes, sir, that I was did. rather nice. Oh, the old two-rose trick, huh? Yes. <laughs> and a wandering Jew. <laughs> <laughs> you were very droll, I thought. I hated coming on. I didn't want to break you up. Oh, no. He's, he's been wonderful tonight. Yeah, the seat seems strange. I know it's hard. I, I don't feel there yet. We have a little see. stool. Do you want a stool to put your feet on? Well, well, no, it's quite nice. I feel endearing. Do you have a little stool coming out from under there? Is that more comfortable? Ooh. You didn't do that for me. <laughs> No, we've had that there. Oh, I don't think I've ever had it here. No, it's fine. It's interesting. How are you? I'm just fine. How you been? I'm all right. <laughs> oh, <laughs> really? No, madam, I was not laughing at you, ma'am. Do you know something about me? No, madam, I've only read those things. <laughs> <laughs> and I have these pictures that no. <laughs> <laughs> Which are available for, for yes, purchase. Like show you, I'm sure you have. I'm sure you have. No, but man. it is shown in England now, isn't it? We got, yeah, some of our shows mm. are seen over there. So I think that it all should be very different for England. Yeah, I hope so. Shines forth. Ah, well, Something like that. 
Tell me about, somebody told me you have, and I don't know that there's a put on or not. You're keeping lizards, is it, am I right? Oh, yes. In your yes. kitchen. I've got two lizards, tiny lizards, little geckos in my kitchen. Oh. Do you I know what? I have an iguana, what? too. You have an iguana? Yeah, the cockroaches go, oh, yes, we have to leave now. Yes, that's why I've got, I've got, I've got What's them. What's this? we got to go. Is that what, I, I'm is that what they're for? I'm allergic to cockroach spray. Right. And New York is full of cockroaches. We've probably got more cockroaches than you've got medflies. Yeah. And my allergist said I mustn't use a cockroach spray, and he told me to get a... Less a lizard. gecko. Well, I thought one lizard would be a gecko. And would two be would be company. <laughs> so I got two. Two? How big are they? Oh, tiny. Just about that big. And they live behind the refrigerator. And and I, th I haven't seen them since uh, they arrived. But They could have died? <laughs> they could... No, no, no. They, they, they don't like us. They just like eating... Uh, so they come out at night or whenever they come out? Oh, well, they, they, they come out when I'm not in the kitchen. And they eat the cockroaches and then they vanish. And all my cockroaches are gone. And now I'm worried about should I supply some more... No. They were thinking about five years, you're going to move that refrigerator and there's going to be this huge... <laughs> there's a lizard going, I want to talk yeah. to you. Yeah. <laughs> well, oh, you so might eat long back They might there. be breeding. I mean, I, I might have a man and a woman. You and, don't know for uh, sure. No. But I've, I've got names for them. Uh -huh. One is called Busy Lizzie. Busy Lizzie. One is called Art Gecko. Art Gecko. You cute. like that? Cute. Groans. I'm not a comedian. It's not bad. And their first child will be called the Lizard of Oz. That's not bad. Ah, that's very good. Not bad, is it? That's not does bad. It does it really? Actress. Does it really work? Yes. Oh, truly, it really does. Mm. I'm surprised somebody has not started a business uh, of selling those. Well, maybe I have tonight. Geckos. Rent a, gecko. Rent a gecko. Rent a gecko. No, get a gecko. Get, get a gecko. Get, yeah. a get a gecko today for a friend. <laughs> We'll do this. We'll be right back and find out about your gecko and mine. Were you serious when you said you had a, a lizard also? An iguana. An iguana? That's For bigger. the same reason? Bigger, yes, much bigger. He couldn't live behind the refrigerator. He has a little condominium on the side. <laughs> I'm hungry now. How about some hamburger, okay? <laughs> Flies, roaches, eats them all. Well, you can yeah. take in roach motels, I suppose, from yes. other people's apartments. See them on one, one spider hanging out the front going, need room for two? <laughs> <laughs> Do you know they're very strong? Not a friend one, of mine, one. um, uh, geckos. No, I didn't know A friend that. of mine saw a tiny lizard attack a moth in South America. Well, a really a moth big isn't moth. very big. No, it was a big moth. Oh. And the moth took off, and the lizard jumped up, and the moth sailed through the air with the lizard hanging to it, and the lizard brought it down and Dumped it to death. <laughs> There's a moral to this story somewhere. Yes. <laughs> or maybe some myth. Never Mar Marlon, Perkins. Perkins. Marlon Perkins should have been there, yes. While Jim is aboard the giant moth. <laughs> <laughs> I will attempt to wrestle him to the ground. That's right. I'll be in the tent with a pitcher of margaritas. Marlon never, Marlon never went out of the tent. Jim did all the work. Marlon was getting... Jim oh. is now attempting to circumcise a rhino. <laughs> <laughs> It's so hard to find them nowadays. <laughs> uh oh, there he goes now. 